welcome back to our channel today it's your lady mandy thank you thank you thank you to all my returning subscribers those of you keep coming back to watch my videos i do appreciate you so much god bless you for always returning to watch my videos i love you so much but god loves you more i want to appreciate my first time viewers you are seeing my face for the very first time my name is mandy i'm married with kids okay welcome to this great family where i share with you tips on spirituality diy and beauty tips okay god bless you as you click on this channel but for you to be part of us please do where to hit that red subscribe button the subscription is was absolutely worth free then turn on your notification bell so that if there's an upload coming from me you will be the first to be notified god bless you as you do so please do where to like my videos share my videos and comment on my videos god bless you so much so without wasting much of our time we'll be talking about what how to break spells how to break curses how to destroy spells within 50 seconds you have broken that spell that curse that is working against you now if you know you are interested you want to know how to carry out this ritual then you have to stay with me to the end of this video all right so we'll be talking about what is curses curses are those things those negative words that have been released on you on a man out there on a woman out there by your enemies sometimes it is not your enemy sometimes it's as a result of what you as an individual has done maybe you have offended someone you have hurt someone so deeply and this person is not happy with you and the person releases a cause you know it will affect you because you are not you are not free of the guilt okay but if you are not guilty and someone releases a cost on you the heaven the universe will fight for you okay so today we are talking about those ones who have searched themselves and they have not offended anyone sometimes you offend people without even knowing that is just the truth sometimes we offend people without knowing it but to them because they have this bitter heart they don't forgive easily they will go ahead and say because you did something to me someone else will do it to you maybe you deceived someone maybe you and someone did a business you deceived the person you took the lion's share the person might release a curse on you say because you deceived me because you, you you know you cheated on me someone else will cheat you all the days of your life and before you know it will begin to happen you begin to experience cheating from one person to another okay or maybe you are in a relationship you are cheating on your girlfriend um or you're doing something that is not good you're hurting that particular soul that particular soul may be weeping and crying and you know in agony might just voice out something that the universe the earth picks okay and begin to work against you that is why sometimes people say i have not done anything wrong but yet of course it's working on you because you have done something without knowing and sometimes it is done by just people that are just envious okay just jealous of you they don't want anything good to come to you then some people causes are inherited maybe you inherited from your family maybe there was a time in your family maybe your father or your mother has committed a blunder somewhere committed a crime or committed something that is bad against a human and that family decide to lay cause it upon you to your next generation to your 10th generation this thing will keep affecting you people because you did so okay then you see it happening you might be you have searched yourself and you are not a kind of connected to anything negative but yet you keep experiencing a particular maybe you're someone that is experiencing sickness 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 sickness. maybe your dad was a doctor he ignored someone at the point of death and before you know that person died that person might say because you ignored him or her at the point of death you know your family will suffer sickness all the days of their life and before you know it it will begin to happen because you deeply hit hurt someone okay so causes has different ways it can come into people's life there are inherited causes there are self uh, attracted um, causes there are causes that are done by enemies released by enemies okay also spells you know sometimes some spells work on us because we are guilty as charge okay okay some spells work on us because we are not spiritually strong some spells work because when you check it in the realm of the spirit this person is actually guilty 
okay so that is it if you know you are experiencing anything that you feel like this must be a cause or this must be a spell then you have to take this ritual i'm about to teach very very serious it is very simple but very very what effective okay so what you will need for this particular ritual is your egg i'm not talking about your agric egg i'm talking about your native egg if you can see in my video what i have here is my what native egg okay you get your native egg is not expensive just go to any shop you will see any herbal shop okay you will get this native egg there all right then the next item you will need is a coconut you get a coconut all right we all know what is coconut i don't have to explain more then the third item is a firewood ashes all right get to any place where they use firewood to cook or do anything to cook you know make sure you get firewood the ashes of that place uh, of that particular um, um firewood that has stayed overnight maybe they use it to cook today the next morning normally in the morning they remove the ashes before they set up another fire so make sure in the morning you go and pick it because what you need is overnight firewood all right the one that has stayed overnight uh, uh, ashes i mean not firewood overnight ashes so you get it and your coconuts and then your native egg these are the three things you will get now after getting these three items what will you be doing with it we all know the power of coconuts no one knows the mystery behind that water inside that is how it is very difficult for any man to understand all right how the powers the the uh, the, 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 the potency of coconut is it has a lot of spiritual potency it does a lot the the benefit spiritual benefits of coconut are numerous that i cannot begin to mention them now so what you do you know also native egg when it comes to prayer it is very powerful the ashes i'm talking about superb all right so what you do is to get um a little plate a little plate when you get this plate you are going to break just just one egg inside that plate all right when you break this egg inside that plate then you open the coconut water open the coconut from one of the eyes if you check it you will see the particular eye that is accessible you open it and pour the water into this um egg pour it into this egg all right do not pour it to be watery just you know to be too much if the water is much because some coconut has a lot of water I just want something that will form a paste okay the paste not too watery all right then you add it into this um egg you have broken in that plate then you get your ashes and add it make sure you have a handful of ashes you add it inside then you mix it together use this your middle finger to turn it stir it as you're stirring it you're declaring you know you call upon your creator your guardian angel your ancestors you tell them that you want to destroy you know what is bothering you if yours is promised and fail you mention the reason why you're kind of this ritual that i am doing this ritual or i am kind of this ritual because i want to stop this issue of promise and fail in my life i want to stop this issue of setback in my life i want to stop these issues of um rejection in my life so as you're staring it you're saying it then after saying it you're going to remove your clothes okay then you carry that mixture rub it from your head as you're rubbing it you're declaring that as i apply this i wash away every disappointment every setback in my life whatever that is not planted by my heavenly father that i remove it out of my life i destroy every negativity every cause every spell okay as you keep you apply it from your face down to your toe okay then after applying it you keep declaring those words that as you cleanse as you cleanse with this mixture you are removing every negativity you break that spell you break that course working in your life so after applying it you allow it to rest like five minutes on your body five minutes on your body then the remaining coconut water add it into an ordinary water add it into what an ordinary water and use it to cleanse your body from your head to toe you just use it to clean that after you have allowed the paste you apply on your body to rest for like five minutes then you come 
with a bucket of water add the remaining coconut water inside even if it's little it is something okay so you add it inside and then use it to cleanse your body you keep declaring remember a closed mouth is a closed destiny so make sure you are saying something all right so you keep saying it that as i cleanse i remove every negative energy wherever it is coming from today i reject i re i destroy you promise and fear is broken you 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 um uh, rejection is destroyed every form of disfavor is destroyed anything causing limitation in my life is destroyed so after cleansing by the grace of god there's something i almost forgot please when you're doing this put four seed of alligator pepper in your mouth four seed of alligator pepper in your mouth while you're doing this then after cleansing allow your body to dry do not towel it do not you know towel it to dry allow it to dry on its own okay then and that is it by the grace of god have faith that what you have done there must be changes in your life you can do this at least once every month once every month because there are some enemies that if they notice that what they have done to you that there is a difference or they notice that something is not right they will go and redo it again so that is why you must not play with your spiritual life you keep doing it even if it's once in a month but the thing is that sometimes we are lazy to practice spirituality so try your best once in a month you do this ritual for yourself it will help you i was just sitting preparing another video to do but this particular um, um particular ritual hit my mind you know it came and i just had to do it immediately if you can see i am not even <laughs> i am not dressed for anything i just had to rush wear my clothes and immediately i have to shoot this video before i forget it drops like a bomb okay it is for causes to remove spells you know it destroys it so please do this and return back with your testimony this is not magic but give it time you will see your changes okay as you do it the heaven the universe will prove themselves you will definitely see changes god bless you and see you in my next one Bye.